All right, this tutorial is to show you how to install uh, MyBB bulletin board. Uh, we're going to start. Uh, you need to already download that. Uh, we're going to start by extracting the files. You know what? Actually, I'm just going to do extract here. Inside that archive, you'll see an upload folder and a documentation. And what we want to do, we want to take and cut, select cut, and then we're going to go to our XAMPP uh, folder their HT docs. Where is that? All right. And then we're going to paste that there. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to, I like to rename this. So I'm going to do uh, my BB and this creates a subfolder. All right. Next we need to create a database for it. So we're going to open our web browser and go to localhost and PHP my admin and we're going to log in to our root account all right now we need to create a new database you can name it whatever I'm just going to name it uh, my BB for easy identification all right I'm going to click the home tab again then we'll click privileges then we'll click add new user and then here I'm going to specify, uh, I'm going to just use my BB user. I'm going to select localhost. And then for the password, I like to use the uh, generate feature. And we'll take and select and copy that. And I'm going to just go ahead and click copy, which applies it to these two fields. For database, I'm going to select none. I'm going to leave everything unchecked. And I'm going to click go. All right. Now it says I've added a new user. Now what I want to do, I want to scroll down again, and then right here you'll see uh, database specific privileges, and we want to select uh, MyBB, and it'll bring this up, and now what we want to do, I usually just uh, click check all, and then I uncheck all the administration stuff, and then I click go. Alright, and now we're done here. So, uh, so next we need to go to localhost forward slash my bb forward slash install and then press enter and you'll be taken to this screen here so we click next and we agree to the license all right everything's green here so we're good to go with that all right now we need to enter the uh, database the information uh, if you're running XAMPP, uh, this is fine you'd actually want to use this one uh, the server host is localhost username I said uh, my BB user and then uh, next for the password I'm just gonna paste that big long password that I copied and then for the database name it was my BB all right now you don't have to remember this password because this is the only time uh, you will use it and you can always go in uh, PHP my admin and change it later if you need to if you forget it alright everything is done so now we click next and then next again and next again alright now here you can uh, go ahead and name your forum name it whatever and then uh, URL to your forum, uh, you specify whatever your domain name is or IP address, whatever you're using, and then uh, the folder. Now, if you have a website that you're using in conjunction with this, you could uh, enter your website here. I'll do uh, one uh, my own server, and then I'll type in my uh, server's uh, my own server domain name. All right, and then cookie path, you can leave that as is, and then you can uh, enter your contact email address here. We'll click next. All right, now we need to create an administrator account. Uh, I wouldn't recommend using this. I'm just showing this as an example, but enter in your information, then uh, admin at local. And then you would enter the appropriate email address, of course. Click next. Alright, 
And now you can see uh, it says here that your uh, says somewhere the installation. Oh, okay. The installer has been locked. You can uh, leave it there because it's locked, or you can uh, or you can delete it. Uh, now you have a choice to either go to your bulletin board or your admin control panel. We'll go ahead and go to the bulletin board first. And as you can see, now we have uh, we have our brand new bulletin board. And down here, you can see uh, the mail to admin at local host. You can see with the link to my website as well, and so that's why you would have entered that. Return the, and then you got a. It's even got RSS syndication uh, built in. That's pretty cool. If you want uh, the ability for people to uh, subscribe to your blog, I mean to your uh, forum, which is even nice. I was looking at this earlier, and you can uh, you can actually subscribe to just one particular forum and not the whole uh, forum altogether. So if you want to track a one specific uh, area. Now, if you want to log into your admin account, you just uh, you just log in as an admin, and then once you uh, once you've logged in on your admin account, you have the admin control panel as well, and now you can uh, log in again. All right, and now you're uh, now you're in your admin uh, control panel, and that's how you install MyBB on a Windows XAMPP server.